Hi, my friends. Today we uh, model this part, number nine, from my collection of 100 parts. As usual, we start by using the standard millimeters template and then we look to the drawing. This is the drawing. Another part of revolution, mostly, we start by creating this uh, section, half section of the part. As usual, I uh, advise you to be very careful because we try to make our best in order to teach you how to create models in Inventor. The first dimension is 34.8 millimeters. Then the diameters 69, uh, 44, and 4. Yes, these are the first. This is 34.8 home. And now we have a first redimensioning of the part. Then we project using center line the the x the axis x. Good. Now, this diameter of uh, 69, interior, twenty four point five, exterior. 44 and the thickness of uh, 4 millimeters. Next, we create this uh, clearance 43 is diameter and uh, 2.5 the Uh, length. Now be very careful because I draw two lines one, two, and then I use trim to cut this. And now instead of uh, launching extend, I keep pressed the key shift and I choose this in order to extend. If I depress now, I didn't make anything. If I depress now the shift, you see I cut this. If I press again, I extend. So these two uh, tools are complementary. Yes? If I launch trim I use a shortcut X extend doesn't have a shortcut then I uh, launch trim for both trim and extend with extend using uh, shift you have to learn this because it is useful this diameter is 
43 and the length is 2.5 Good. Now, two other clearances, uh, a radius one at the distance of 2.5 from the uh, sides. Let's create them. I create a circle on the line, on the line, with a radius one and another one you see I have a selected radius and now I can uh, deselect to have uh, the diameter as the dimension but I want to be radius 1 distances of 2.5 from the sides and now the circle are fixed no problem with them line is fixed everything is fixed trim I choose to trim this diameter and I choose to split not trim the other one not the circle but the line you see if I uh, select the circle uh, two points appears because the circle cannot be cut in one virtual point you see but a line can be cut in two parts uh, uh, using uh, this X point I cut here and I cut here why these two solutions well this one is to be modified as constructor constructive line and this one has the problem you see uh, the diameter here is disappeared yes because I cut it this circle I have to add the diameter for you to uh, uh, be sure I apply control Z several times And now the diameter is here. When you choose to use trim, like here, the diameter disappears. Because uh, you have to realign these lines. This is why I use split split in one point and then the other one this point and this point and now I convert these two lines let me enlarge to construction and the diam diameter is not disappeared this is not well trimmed now it is if I choose this I choose the diameter if I select here I select the diameter this is why I have to make this selection now everything is okay trim for these two arcs nothing is loose 
So I recommend you to use split instead of trim in some situation, not everywhere. Now uh, all is done and we can apply revolve. Okay, this is a chamfer of two millimeters. I'll show you right now. This is two or 45 millimeters. And now there is a cut on the side of the part, but only in one half of it, not all the way uh, through the part. Okay, this means that we choose, we select this plane where we draw a rectangle. This is the rectangle. We project this geometry to have the midpoint of it because I select coincident and I place this point over the midpoint of the projected line. The dimensions are uh, 2 and 5. 2 millimeters. Oh, excuse me dimension. Two millimeter this and five millimeters the other one. <coughs> Finish sketch, extrude, cut all the way in that direction. Okay what next? Next and last is to place this three holes equidistant with these dimensions. The first one is here and the other with the using uh, the circular pattern we uh, repeat them in other two uh, positions. On this face we create a simple point which is to be on the same horizontal with the center and the dimension is 56 divided by 2. 56 divided by 2. Never we create dimensions from our head. We have here the expression. When you want to see how it is, you look here. Okay? You use uh, expressions instead of calculating by head any dimension. Finish sketch. And now, hole. I already used this. Dimensions are 12. 90 degrees and 5.2. These are also here. Yes, 12, 90, 5.2. Uh, okay. This is the hole. The other two with circular pattern. Yes, we choose the feature from here or from here. The axis, this is 
axis and 3 as a number. Anything else? Oh, there is a cut here. This cut of uh, 26 millimeters. Nothing simpler. Face, sketch, line. I, I choose the uh, points on the circumference of the circle. Yes. And the dimension was 26. Yes. 26. Finish. Now you have to extrude this. Cut all the way. Okay. This is the part. We choose, say, steel carbon, not semi polished, but polished, steel polished, steel, 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 polished to be very clear and nice. Yes, this is our part. Its data are here. I properties, physical, update, see them here. Okay, this is all for today. Bye-bye.